this, uh, this is Adit. Today I am going to show you the demo in that how to include the data from your file uh, in your uh, database expression so that you can process your request uh, or data as per your convenience and send back to next component or third party uh, any third party entity or external entity or like any request right so this is the uh, uh, this is the preview i have one data view here let me remove this data view okay let me right here uh, i have i will have one more data view here okay i'll keep this one and uh, let me create one first let me see I, if i have one file yeah i have one file here data is like this okay so i, I will include this data in my uh, data view of file data okay in that uh, read url i will use the here Class path and uh, I use class one this part here. First, this is work like uh, this class of uh, the, the resources, the path of the resources is work as a class path for the class path for the data view. Okay, so this one and content and use like uh, application and this. Okay. Now I use I will use here this one. Okay, so I'll go. You see here the data which was in the file is now printed over here, right? This was in the file itself, it's printed here. Also you can Add something like uh, um, class twelve. Okay, so we'll add some new component like in in array or like this, or uh, you can remove like uh, anything like uh, H. Okay. So by by this way, uh, you can see it will remove right because S was uh, A was there. Sorry, uh, this S was here. Now and uh, I'll go over there. I'll keep here and this will as well go. So this way you can include the data which is existing uh, is available in the file. You can put in your uh, scripting language. Or in the JSON language here, uh, a data view, and you, accordingly you can use uh, in your process. Uh, like uh, I'll show you that uh, XML. Okay, this will go to the XML and uh, uh, XML data. data. see that's only that right so it's you can you you can reuse data according to your purpose i this demo was just to show that how to include the file in json uh, using the uh, read url uh, uh, method this is inbuilt method json uh, in data view and you can use the to input parameter here one is the url of the file that is the class part till the resources it will come to it in the resources here to the to the year it will come to the year and then just you have to include the if any folder over there yes it has one folder was here you see this folder was here that was folder and on the file and then the file then it is came in this one and uh, i'll remove that one and show you again that it's not affecting anything see it's coming here so this is coming from here itself. So by this way, you can you can define the you can include the the file here and it will 
it, and uh, this is the kind of input from the in from the file to find by the bit json so i input it input it in json and accordingly i change the, uh, the data, data value okay so by this way you can use the file and input the data from, from file in your application and data view and process accordingly thanks